The Commons leader responded to accusations from her Labour opposite that the PM's agenda ahead of the next general election is embarrassingly thin. Penny Mordaunt hit back at Labour frontbencher Lucy Powell over criticism of the King's speech. Shadow Commons leader Lucy Powell claimed the government's legislative programme is so thin, it's embarrassing. But in response the Commons leader reeled off statistics on Labour's previous record. Speaking during business questions this morning, Ms Powell said, of the few bills announced, five are carryovers, four barely longer than a page, three we've seen before and the flagship crime bill that's already been shelved. Despite the big issues facing our country, their answers are so small. Nothing to tackle the cost of living crisis, just a prime minister deluded that everything is going great. Ms Morden replied, she is rather fond of criticising our record past and also what we're planning to do in this session. I think it would be helpful just to get the scores on the doors there. She believes that the 43 bills, 1,000 statutory instruments and a record number of private bills, 24, passed in the third session, is a shabby record. I would just point out to her that between 1997 and 2010, 13 parliamentary sessions, there were only two sessions that put through more bills than we passed in the last parliamentary session. And in the last sessions of Labour administrations, the average number of bills brought forward were 21. She can't justify the charge she makes against us about the amount we have got done. She might be relying on the amount of time it took us. It did take us less time than we had allocated to pass a lot of that legislation and do government business. But that's not really a problem for these benches, it's more a problem for the opposition benches.